Proofpoint Email Protection helps secure and control your inbound and outbound email. It uses machine learning and multi-layered detection techniques to identify and block malicious email from reaching your inbox. By processing billions of messages each day, Proofpoint sees more threats, detects them faster, and better protects you against hard-to-detect threats. Here's a brief tutorial on how to access and use Proofpoint. Once KP Interface creates an account for you, you will receive a welcome email titled, Your New Proofpoint Essentials Account. The email will come from do not reply at proofpointessentials.com. After opening the email, click the Set Password button. This should take you to the Proofpoint site for setting your password. If you already have an account, the portal can be accessed at us1.proofpointessentials.com. On the login page, enter your corporate email address and password, and then click Sign In. Once logged in, you'll have access to additional features like reviewing quarantined emails, customizing preferences, and managing your allow block sender lists. We'll come back to the portal and its features shortly, but for now, let's start with what most users interact with every day, the Daily Digest emails. Reviewing the Daily Digest. Most users primarily interact with Proofpoint through the Daily Digest, which provides a convenient summary of quarantined messages. From the Digest, you can Preview Securely view the contents of a quarantined email Release Deliver the quarantined email to your inbox Release and approve Deliver the email to your inbox and whitelist the sender so future emails from them aren't quarantined. Note, user-level whitelists may be superseded by company-level filters or rules. Block Permanently block the sender or domain from delivering emails to your inbox. Digest emails make it easy to manage quarantined messages directly from your inbox without logging into the portal. Navigating the Proofpoint Portal Once you log into the portal, you will be taken to your email log screen, where you will see several filters to view your emails. Type. Select this drop-down to view email that you've received, inbound mail or that you've sent, outbound mail. Status. Here you can pick which types of emails you want to see. Any. This filter pulls all emails, including ones that are delivered to your inbox. Quarantined. All messages currently not delivered. Reported. Misclassified. Messages that were reported in Proofpoint for being spam after being delivered as clean. Blocked. These are messages that have been blocked because of a virus or executable file. Messages that are blocked cannot be released. Cleared. All messages delivered. Cleared, but queued for delivery. Deferred email waiting for delivery. Cleared, but bounced by destination. Messages that were delivered, but bounced at the source destination. Cleared, released from quarantine. Messages initially quarantined but released for delivery. In Attachment Defense Sandbox, these are emails with attachments that Proofpoint has pushed to a safe environment where they then check the attachment for any type of payload. Additional filters on this screen allow you to drill down by date and time range, as well as sender, recipient, and subject. Note, Proofpoint email logs can only go back 30 days. View and action your quarantined emails in the portal. To view a quarantined email on your quarantined email list, scroll to the right until you see the Actions column. Here you can click on the eye icon to securely preview the message. There are action buttons on the bottom of the preview pane that allow you to show images, report as false positive, release or delete the email. If you wish to see a detailed email log entry, Click on the bulleted list next to the I icon. You have options here to make updates, report as a false positive, or print. To take an action on a quarantined email, click the checkbox next to the email or emails that you wish to action. Next, select the Actions drop down. Here you can Release from quarantine. This will send the email to your inbox. Release and approve. This will deliver the email to your inbox and add the sender to your whitelist. Future email from senders on your whitelist will never be quarantined. Resend. 
This will allow an admin or end user the ability to resend an email if the email is stuck in queue or the backend mail server is unresponsive. Report as false positive. Marks the email as a legitimate email, ensuring future emails from this sender are allowed. Report as false negative. Flags the email as spam, improving spam detection for similar messages. Hide email from logs. This option is used when admins or end users just do not want to see these particular spam emails or legitimate emails in the log search anymore. Mind you that using this option is not reversible. Managing allow and block sender lists. In the Proofpoint portal, you can customize your email filtering by managing the allow and block sender lists. This feature gives you the ability to allow senders or domains by specifying trusted email addresses, for example, joe at company.com, or entire domains, like enterprise.net, to ensure their emails are always delivered to your inbox. It also allows you to block unwanted email addresses or domains to prevent their messages from ever reaching your inbox. Note, user-level allow lists may be superseded by company-level filters or rules. The Emergency Inbox the Emergency Inbox allows users to send and receive email when their company mail systems are offline. The Emergency Inbox will automatically begin populating your email when your mail systems stop receiving email. The Emergency Inbox can be used to send new messages as well as reply to received messages. Once email delivery has been restored, any messages that were sent, both new and replies, are automatically delivered to the mail server. You should contact your company administrator to learn more about when to use the Emergency Inbox. How to access the Emergency Inbox Log into the Proofpoint portal. Click Emergency Inbox on the left panel. A new window with your Emergency Inbox will pop up, allowing you to compose, send, reply, and forward emails similar to how you use your company email system. Final Notes no automated system is perfect. There will be times when a legitimate email message is quarantined as spam. We recommend that you review your quarantined messages periodically, either in your digests or by logging on to the Proofpoint portal. For additional questions, please reach out to KP Interface at kpinterface.com/supportcenter.